Hey guys, I have a quick grocery haul I wanted to share with you. I went to the Walmart affiliate and picked up some stuff. I'm going to be going to the grocery store a few times this week because I meal prepped or I meal planned for the week. So I'm going to just be picking up the items as I go. So just to start out, today's Monday. I got some ginger ale. This was in the car, in the trunk. I'm assuming my husband bought that. He went shopping a couple of days ago and picked up a bunch of fruits and veggies, mostly fruits. So I'm assuming this is from Nat Hall. I did not film it. Sorry about that. Potatoes, corn, and pumpkin. That's gonna go in my red bean soup for tonight. I got four cans of beans for the red bean soup tonight. Picked up some mandarin oranges because they were on sale. The naan, that's going to be a side for the red bean soup tonight. Just ran out of the whole grain wraps for my husband's breakfast burritos today, so I picked up another pack. Some eggs because we just ran out. Two more of these nutritional equate shakes. Y'all, my stomach has been fighting with me the last few days because I've been eating like crap. So back on track this week and hoping that I can get back to how I've been eating normally because the last two weeks have been insane. So these help with like substituting a meal for me if I'm hungry and I don't really feel like eating because right now the soup sounds good, but I don't know about the rest of the week how everything else is going to be sounding to me. So I have that. Then we ran out of teas. So I got green tea, the orange, ginger, the mixed fruit, and the ginger lime. I got some complete seasoning that's going in the soup. I got this pinguino snack, the cream filled cupcake just to have in the pantry. Whole grain bread because we ran out. Goldfish crackers, Cheez Its. And then these were on sale. So I picked up two bags of these for my husband. And then I also picked up two of these. These are the Yummy Nuts brand. Just looked really good. This is a party mix. And that is the nut mix. And this is the Omega mix. Non food items. We ran out of Moringa pills. My cleaning lady asked me to stock back up on a couple of items, which I knew I needed to anyway, so I got some of this great value anti-fungal cleaner for the bathroom, this anti-grease cleaner for the bathroom and the kitchen, some more Clorox bleach, this brush. I got this for the kids' bathroom. It's a neutralizing spray. It's kind of like the poopery. Two gloves, one for the bathroom, one for the kitchen. And then these brushes are amazing. So I needed to get a couple more of those as well. And that's what I picked up today. Stay tuned for the rest of the hauls for this week. Okay, so I'm going to start with this stuff first. And then I'm going to show you the rest of the groceries I picked up for this week. So I went into a local shoe store. And they were having a sale on their shoes, so I picked up some everyday shoes that I can wear because my favorite everyday shoes broke. So I needed to replace those, and I haven't been able to go back to my favorite shoe store. So I just went ahead and bought these. They weren't the cheapest, but they were on sale, like I said, for a little less than 30 bucks. So I went ahead and picked those up because I do need some like everyday heels like this so that I can like run around do errands go to the mall things like that and then I went to the makeup store and I picked up a couple of things I bought a few new things that I've never bought before but I'm going to try these out I've never done uh, blush like ever I do simple makeup but I want to kind of like get into what the girlies have been doing and so I bought some Milani cream blush so i'm gonna try that for like when i'm doing a full face getting glam for events formal dances next week so i want to like be prepared for that and then i got this trio contour set 
also never contoured my face before so I'm also going to try that I also picked up this setting spray something I've never done so I got the Milani make it last dewy finish setting spray I also got some mattifying primer something I've also never used so this is all going to be new for me I'm going to have to watch some tutorials to see like how to use all of this stuff but this is the Milani no pore zone mattifying primer with lily and bamboo extracts I also got some highlight again never used highlight so I'm excited for that these aren't necessarily colors that I would normally buy but I liked this one so I'm going to go ahead and try this. And then I got a brow pencil and I got some more of these beauty tool, like the face shaver tools that I use. So I got a three set of those. All right. So voice over time. I wanted to show you guys the rest of everything that I bought for the week, but I'm going to show you a couple of items first because I was actually in the middle of making dinner and I didn't want to not include these items in my haul. So I was making pesto pasta for dinner this night, so I bought some pesto and I also bought the bow tie pasta because I just figured that was more fun. And pesto pasta was on the menu because my middle son requested that for dinner. I also got some baguette bread because I was going to use that to make garlic bread. And I usually buy garlic bread from Auto Mercado already made. It tastes just like the garlic bread from Olive Garden. But I hadn't been to Auto Mercado at all that week. So I just got some baguette and I made my own garlic bread. I was also making broccoli to go on the side and then this is everything that I was prepping for dinner. So here's everything else that I picked up today. Hopefully this will suffice until Sunday. We'll see. But knowing me, I might have to run back in and get a couple more things just to kind of bulk up our meals for the next few days. So it is currently Wednesday. I went into the Walmart affiliate. I got two cans of lentils because I'm going to do that one night. Then I got two cans of red beans. I'm thinking of doing the cheat rice and peas. Some hand soap for the bathrooms. I just got this big container. It's in like this bag or whatever because I know the kids for sure are running out. So I wanted to get some to stock them back up on some hand soap sponges this is a two pack and then this is the one I use to wash our pots and pans so these craft macaroni and cheese spirals look new to me so I picked up two boxes of those these chips right here were on sale they were less than three dollars which I thought was a really good deal because this alone is over five bucks normally so I got that two pack and then I had bought this and my son and I had a couple in the car these cheese fix munchie snacks really good I got these lemon cream cookies because these are bomb and then I got two of these Prince cheese and broccoli penne pasta mixes just to have in the pantry Got some artisanal hamburger buns and some whole grain artisanal bread before we run out. Some mini onions because they were a good price. The popcorn chicken because this is going to be a meal for Friday. Some tomatoes. They were on sale. I showed you guys the baguette, but it was three for like $2 and some change. So I got three and I used one for garlic bread like I mentioned. So I'm just going to have these on hand in the pantry for sandwiches. Paper towels for the bathrooms, a three-pack. Two bags of fries for Friday, the Super Crisp McCain's French fries and these Walmart seasoned potato wedges. Some hash browns. These were expensive, in my opinion. 
and the Meatless Farms the plant based burgers again for Friday. And that's everything I picked up from the Walmart affiliate. Oh, and before I forget, because I did, I've got some more like squash or pumpkin because I want to make pumpkin coconut rice one night this week. <laughs> 